here new happening today. A police officer who shot and killed a black man in Brooklyn Center, Minnesota, will now head to court. She's facing a second degree manslaughter charge. CBS 4's Eric Pointer is live in the newsroom with the latest on this case. A lot of new information here, Eric. That's right. The 26 year veteran is now out on a $100,000 bond. She was arrested and charged with second degree manslaughter for the death of 20 year old Dante Wright. Now, if found guilty, Potter faces up to 10 years in prison and a $20,000 fine. And that's according to Minnesota law. She's scheduled for her initial court appearance this afternoon. While she has resigned and faces these charges, some activists say it's not enough and they continue to protest last night. Minnesota law enforcement spoke earlier early this morning about the situation. We will continue to use the least harmful tools we have available to preserve and protect protest people's first amendment right, but we will stop violence and criminal activity. Around two dozen people were arrested during last night's protest in Brooklyn Center. We're told it was mostly out of towners. Police say despite the crowds, there were no large fires or looting and that they appreciate how many people obeyed the city's 10 p.m. curfew. Wright's family asked that all protesters keep things peaceful. We also know that the police chief who claimed that Potter accidentally used her gun instead of her taser has resigned. In the newsroom, Eric Pointer back to you in the studio, Nick. All right, Eric.